Hello and welcome back to the Art of Cooking with Sally Gooden. I'm Wanda Thrill Kill, aka Sally Gooden. And today's episode is the Get Out to Vote. I want everyone, please, that are registered to vote, get out there and vote. Vote early. Do not wait till November the 3rd. Watch it on TV November the 3rd. So get out and vote right after you look at this video. Today's apron is by James Threadkill. It's called Vote for the Chef. Vote for the Chef. And in this episode of Vote for the Chef, we are going to make the salmon croquettes. Yes, salmon croquettes, one of the favorites during breakfast and also doing some dinners. People love to serve their salmon patties, some people call them, but salmon croquettes. So today's episode, salmon croquettes, please get out and vote. Here are your ingredients. Okay, first thing you do, you open up your can of salmon and you want to drain some of this juice off of it. Alright, and you pour it in your bowl. Not all the juice, just some of it. Because some of the juice you want to use. And I like to take this little bone part out. It's um, right up in here. See that little bone? I personally don't like that. Some people mix theirs up in there and say that you can't taste it, but I always take mine out. So, taking out the bone. Now that we have our bones out of our salmon and we've mixed it, we mushed it all up, you're going to add the chopped red peppers and you're gonna add your chopped onions these are probably like maybe a half a cup of red peppers and a half a cup of onions something like that anywhere from a cup to a half a cup want to mix those in there then you have an egg kind of stir it up mix that in there And your seasonings. I have the Obey. I have the garlic and herb seasoning. Just a little bit of salt because you know salmon in a can is kind of salty. And this is white pepper. It's white pepper. All right. Gonna mix that in. Alright, so you can get all ready. Now, this is the combo of two cups of cornmeal mix. I'll use the buttermilk cornmeal mix. Half cup of flour. You want to kind of mix in between adding it. Don't just dump it in there. You have to mix it a little bit. And actually, I'm going to put this spoon down and use my hands to mix that in. Because I want it to get in there good. Mix the cornmeal and flour mixture in the sand. Also, you make sure that your oil is getting hot. You need to preheat your oil. Make sure it's hot like you're frying the chicken or something. You may have to, in the process of frying it, cut it down. But you don't want to burn the sand. It's starting to form, so I'm gonna stop right there because when it starts looking like this, you got enough flour and meal in there. All right, now moving over here, I've got my plate here ready to put the salmon in, and we're gonna make a, a ball. 
and form the patties. I'm going to just take a little bit just to test, a little bit of this flour. Test my oil. Alright, it's not ready to fry yet. So, we're going to let it get hot and then we're going to add the salad. Okay, I tested my oil. The oil is hot. Now you're going to form your patties and fry them in your oil. You want them to get brown on each side, so I'm gonna put about four of these in there in this skillet. This side skillet. And I'm gonna let them cook until I see brown around the edges. And once I see brown around the edges, I'll flip it over and let it brown on the other side. Okay, so you're looking at the brownness around the edge of your salmon croquettes, and that's when you know it's time to flip it over. Nice and brown around the edges, and then let it cook brown on the other side. And they are kind of slightly floating. That lets you know that it's getting done, and they kind of float in your oil. We're going to let those cook on that side. All right, now these are ready. Take out of the pan, put on the paper towel to drain. Okay. Hot, hot, hot. This is the way they should look. Okay, and while I finish um, frying the rest of these salmon croquettes, here's a word from our artist, James Thrillkill. Hey, YouTube viewers. Thank you for tuning in once again to The Art of Cooking with Sally Gooden. I'm artist James Thrillkill, and I'm happy once again to bring you another apron for this particular edition. The theme for this apron is called Vote for the Chef. And with this election season, I thought it would be appropriate to create an apron that related to the importance of voting. And so this apron is casting a vote for a very incredible chef, as we all know, with the fabulous Wanda Thrill Kill. Once again, we appreciate you hitting the thumbs up button, subscribing to the channel, sharing the video, and just really appreciate you tuning in to watch all the different recipes that Wanda's putting together with the assistance of the very talented Channing Thrill Kill. So we'll see you next time, and thank you for tuning in once again. Take care. All right, so our salmon croquettes has this texture, tenderness. On the inside, like I said, this is one of my popular um, things to make during breakfast when I have the brunch. I always make sure I include salmon croquettes. Get out and vote. Have some salmon.